Hey guys, this is David. So uh, this is what I uh, soldered together. This is the description. You can see it was two twenty-five and another dollar fifty. It came extremely fast. It was so three seventy-five. And this is the seller. If you like to solder, this would be a perfect project for you. So I bought a Arduino Nano, and this is what it kind of looks like. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to be soldering the uh, the pins on it today. So I put the little Nano on a breadboard, and I'm heating up my soldering iron right now. Uh, this is my little um, handy dandy uh, hands, helping hands, and my soldering iron. And the project is to do some surgery and to um, get all these little um, header pins uh, soldered up. So uh, I'm not a good solder at all and I have a really uh, not so great soldering iron. But I'm going to try it and see if I can uh, get this thing going. Thanks. And I kind of soldered everything. Uh, I didn't do a great job soldering. It's either my soldering skills suck or the soldering iron is pretty bad, but it took me a while and I didn't have a lot of fun soldering this thing. So I'll turn it on and see what happens. That's all. Holy crap, these pins were kind of hard to solder. And now it looks like we have a power button and a blinking light, so it gives me a little bit of hope that this thing is working. So I have my uh, Blink program going. Uh, this is like the first program that you learn. Blink, very simple program. I just, uh, just changed the delay a little bit just to see what was going on. And I'll show you the Nano going. So this is my Nano with the uh, poor soldering job, uh, but it's working. Look at that. Uh, that's really about it. So my project has shrunk. Pretty excited. Now I have a uh, Nano to play with. Uh, it's going to be exciting. Don't have too many um, ideas of projects I can do yet, but um, looks like it's going. There you go. So what I'm doing here is I'm changing um, the pin number, I'm like 13 to 2 or 7, because um, I'm checking out my soldering. So I'm trying different pins to make sure that this program works in all the pins. So far, it's doing the blinking the way it should. So the soldering job was okay, even though it was a little sloppy, but it seems to be working. So I'm happy that the soldering is holding up and everything is good.